Welcome to East Coast LQ Reviews. Today I have Canadian Club 100% rye whiskey. So this is uh, imported Canadian whiskey. 40% alcohol by volume, so it's 80 proof. This uh, 750 milliliter, I believe, is going to cost you around 20 bucks anywhere you go. So on the bottle it says, made from single grain rye. Uh, on the side it says, our master distillers bring you a whiskey made from single grain rye, spicy, rich, with a hallmark smoothness of Canadian Club. Makers of exceptional rye whiskey for over 150 years. So I'm going to pour this into this uh, Chivas glass I actually got. It's a pretty nice glass. Okay, so let's put the smell in those. Um, definitely get like a, a maple sweetness. Um, you get a heavy spice smell. A little bit of vanilla. Um, not much oak. Um, makes me think that it wasn't really aged very long. Um, so I believe regular Canadian whiskey only uses a little bit of rye, and uh, this is 100% rye. So um, good for the taste. Um, you get the rye grain note right up front. Um, it's kind of got like that maple sweetness to it um, in, the, in the middle. Um, and then it finishes off with like a, 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 a blend of like spices. Um, yeah, it's not really too harsh though. It's actually uh, pretty smooth. Uh, it's pretty low in alcohol. 40% uh, It's not too bad. It's pretty low for uh, an average whiskey. So I'm going to pull some stuff up on... Um, their website so if you want to check them out you can go to www.canadianclub.com slash us and at the top it's it'll say our products oh, excuse me and you can go to uh, the different whiskeys they have so if you go to Canadian Club 100% uh, uh, rye excuse me <laughs> I've been drinking a little bit um, so the color of it let me get another pour on this. Is antique gold? It's saying aroma is balanced with toasted grains, gentle wood notes, and a tantalizing hint of sweet vanilla. On the taste, it's a, a complex balance of rye spiciness, caramel, and oak notes, smooth and creamy. And I'll read the finish in a second. That's a little better of a pour than last time. Um, the finish is a long, clean finish with hints of clove, oak, and vanilla. And once again, the proof is 80 proof or 40% alcohol. Um, the description on it is, this is a whiskey made for those who love rye. It was, cre it was created in the heart of Alberta's unforgiving rye country by a team who ha have spent the last 60 years mas mastering the art of distilling with rye. This whiskey is truly unique and deliciously distinct with caramel and oak notes up front, followed by a spicy finish. It's so good you'll want to sip it neat and so versatile you, you'll want to use it in all rye forward classic cocktails. So now I'm actually going to mix it. Um, and before I mix it, for my rating for it, I'm going to give it a 7, and a, seven out of 10 uh, straight. It's pretty good for the price. It's definitely a good whiskey. Um, this is the first rye I had, and I actually I'm pretty impressed. I kind of like rye. It's right up there with bourbon for me now. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go to pour on this. Mix like two-thirds Coke. One-third whiskey. Let me taste it now. Um, yeah, this is a great mixer. I actually need a little bit more. The whiskey, I think I poured too much coke in it. But yeah, this stuff is great mixed. It's actually kind of dangerous because it's low in proof. You don't really taste it. But um, a lot of the flavors, the vanilla note is uh, brought out a lot. Um, the caramel 
goes pretty well with the caramel from the cola. Um, yeah, and uh, the spices are just, I don't know, it just creates a pretty good drink for rating for this. Uh, mixed, I'm going to give it a 7.5 out of 10. Um, if there's any other whiskeys or uh, beers or vodkas or any other liquor you'd like me to do on my channel, leave a comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Cheers.